Hey guys, welcome back. So you might have seen Oppo's rollable concept phone, a viable alternative to a foldable phone. But since it's not commercially available as it's just a concept device designed to test out the rolling parts, Oppo decided to take a different route for the time being and directed its attention to foldable phones. Now, a reputable Chinese tipster, Digital Chat Station confirmed some of the specs of the upcoming folding phone along with the name which is gonna be Find N5G. The design will resemble popular folding phones such as Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 and the Huawei Mate X2. Yeah, an inward folding design. The leaker further says that the cover screen will be slightly curved at the edges and it will be running at 60Hz refresh rate with a centered punch hole at the top. The main internal screen will use the same punch hole selfie camera design and runs at 120Hz. It's expected to pack a 7.8 to 8 inch 2K OLED display. The fingerprint reader will be placed on the side that will also act as a power button. When it comes to the cameras, the report claims that the smartphone will sport a triple camera setup as seen on the Oppo Reno 6 series with a 50 megapixel IMX 766 primary lens, a 16 megapixel Sony IMX 481, and a 13 megapixel Samsung ISOCELL lens. For video calls and selfies, the device shall have a 32 megapixel front camera. The leaker also said that the device will boot ColorOS based on Android 11 and will be powered by the Qualcomm Snapdragon 888 SoC. Judging by the fact that it is scheduled to launch sometime next month, the specs are up to the mark, although we would love to see Android 12.1 as it's said to be much more optimized for these kind of form factor devices. XD's analysis suggests this new Android 12.1 update may deliver a host of improvements for how the operating system handles large foldable size screens, including offering a better split screen UI, a lock screen that makes better use of horizontal space, and a new taskbar that makes it easier to use multiple apps at once. Most of the improvements relate to how the operating system makes better use of the more horizontal screen real estate. Anyways, the report states that units are reportedly moving through internal channels to stores for employee training, hinting that the phone could be close to release. But Oppo is yet to reveal any detail about the smartphone. For more updates regarding this foldable phone, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching. Peace out.